Hi everyone, just a quick video on break this run out, what it is, uh, what the symptoms are and then how to test for it. So first of all, what is break this run out? Well, break this run out is when the brake disc is no longer flat. So after tens of thousands of heat cycles, this flat surface here that the pads rub against uh, becomes warped and you start getting high spots and low spots on the disc uh, and that creates pedal judder. So as a driver, when you press the brake pedal, the pedal would feel like it's pulsing and bouncing uh, as you're braking. That obviously affects braking efficiency as well when it comes to MOT time. So how are we going to test for it? Well, first of all, make sure your brake disc is nice and tight onto the hub. With these tight with screws, it's not a problem. It's already tied down. Otherwise, use wheel nuts onto the threads up against the brake disc to hold it tight. Uh, we're going to use an engineering tool called a DTI gauge. It's got a magnetic base that's attached to the wheel hub, uh, the wheel uh, strut. And then it's got a set of linkage arms which are nice and tight. It's also got a spring-loaded needle that's put under tension against the disc, so it's not just loosely against there, it's, it's pressed against it to some degree, because obviously we can have low spots as well as high spots. And then down here we've got a, 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 uh, the instrument face, so I've set it to zero just about, I can see it's a tiny bit out, but I'll bear that in, I take that into account. Uh, and you can adjust the face by just turning this little uh, uh, face on the outside here with the teeth, in fact let's just do that, let's get it bang on, there we go. So. Um, that whole face going from zero to uh, back to zero again is, is uh, 10 millimetres. So each 10 effectively is, is uh, one millimetre. For this one, 0 0.04 millimetres is allowed. So that's just four dashes either side of the zero because again, we could have high spots or we could have low spots. So what I'm going to do is turn the brake disc by hand now um, using these threads and we're going to see if it goes beyond 0 0.4 in either direction. If that's the case, the run out is too high and be recommending replacement discs for this car. So here we go. So I'm just rotating the brake disc here by hand. So let's go 0 0.03 one way. 0 0.056. 0 0.09. 11, 12, 13, 14. Just about. And then back to zero and then it goes the other way actually. So 0.04. Alright, so it went 0 point, 0 0.14 in one direction and 0 0.5 in the 0 0.05 in the other direction. So uh, 0 0.19 um, deflection is way too high. So this disc needs replacing uh, as the run out is too high. So the customer is complaining of a juddering pedal, and this is probably why. I will check the other side, but uh, this looks like they need replacing. Hope that makes sense. See you on the next one.